The pioneer feel of the old brick buildings and streets, along with the neat little shops, always makes Jacksonville a great stop. And if you go in the fall, you'll see a great show with the trees. But if you visit on the second Saturday of August or September, you will experience even more. It's part of Jacksonville History Saturday, which we do every second Saturday of the month between uh, May and September. And each month here at the Beekman House, we feature a different aspect of life in the Victorian era. And we look at it through the lens of Jacksonville and the Beekman family. The Beekman family, one of prominence in the founding of Jacksonville, and their house amazingly remains pretty much historically intact. And on August 16th, at that house, it's all about Victorian music and literature. Well, here at the Beekman House, we will have someone playing on our Mathershet piano, which is a one-of-a-kind piano that Cornelius Beekman ordered from New York and had shipped. We'll also be playing records on our Victrola, our 1910 Victrola there, which is unusual in that it's a floor model. Most people had tabletop models, but this was when after Edison had invented the first phonograph. Once you've experienced the history of the Beekman House, you can head downtown for shopping or lunch, and then go on a tour of the old Beekman Bank. So his first order of business was the buying and selling of gold. Uh, Larry Smith, who's our town historian, he is going to be doing behind the bank tours at the Beekman Bank, and he gives a real look at how Beekman ran his bank, because he, saw, he ran, was not only a banker, I mean, he was an entrepreneur. You get to go behind the counter, look in the safe, look in the drawers, and Larry tells you about all of the things that are still there, because when Beekman closed the bank in 1915, he locked the door and it's been that way ever since. If you need a little more sense of adventure, not to worry. Year-round, the trails around Jacksonville from the Brit to the Forest Park system give you miles of uphill climbs, vistas, and views. My dogs, they know all about them. And that trip into historic Jacksonville is this week's Tank of Gas Getaway.